It's interesting, you know, it's a classic UCLA tradition to have to wake up at an obscene hour in the morning and wait in line for a sports event. It's the last game of the season, last game of our senior year, we're all really excited and we're all really tired but we're ready for the ESPN show. I'm ready to go and I'm amped and I'm uh, trying to win some free prizes and go a little crazy for a few hours in the morning before I take a nap for like six. I went to college here, I went to medical school here, and now I work here, and this is truly such an exciting event. I don't remember college game day ever being on campus, so it was really important for me to get up early, 4 o'clock to be exact, to make it out here. Once we got in there, the energy was really high, so all the fans were out there. I mean, I think they're probably more tired than we are. A lot of them <laughs> camped, out. camped out, so... Yeah. We kind of get to walk in, yeah. upsides being in the band and all that. Yeah, but seeing them with lots of energy after spending the night outside just kind of gets, gets us pumped up because if they can do it, we can do it. Yep. <laughs> The Arizona game is kind of special to me because I remember I went to the last game at the old Poly Pavilion where UCLA beat Arizona to close out the old stadium. Me and my friends all decided to dress up as Teletubbies for most of the home games. And it's really special. It's just a great experience, especially to be here with all my friends. And, you know, be dressed up as Teletubbies and going crazy. It's, it's a lot of fun. It's phenomenal in there right now. Everyone's just going crazy. Definitely. I mean, I'm not even tired anymore. We are exhausted, but it's just so worth it. So much energy, so much room pride. This is pretty much the reason we came to a school like this, with a sports team like this. Up shirt, cause we never up in her circle.